sweeties welcome to or back to the channel thank you so much for clicking on in this video I'm going to be showing you how to get box braids simple easy with no hoopla no sitting in the salon chair for eight hours you can do this in five minutes ten minutes tops okay so if you like what you saw in that little clip you're probably wondering okay well what's the tea the tea is we queen has so many different types of box braid wigs, corn roll like wigs, they have it all, okay? This that you saw was a 20 inch box braid wig from them and it's glueless and it comes in many lengths. So if you're a girl that likes shorter box braids, they got you. If you're a girl that like the box braids down to the booty, they got you. So again, this is their 20 inch inside the box you get the wig okay they also give you wig caps okay and then they give you a really nice dust bag it will definitely fit your wig it's a really good size and they also give you a care card on how to take care of your um braided wigs the two combs on each side in the front. You get the comb in the back and the adjustable straps and the glueless band that makes the wig stay on without you having to adhere it. Um, like other wigs, they do not have the detachable band. This one is made on the inside, so if you don't like it, you will have to cut it out, okay? Okay, so when it comes to the lace area of the wig, the front, um, it is a 13 by 4 you're getting the bulk of the lace in the in the top and then it tapers down to about two inches on both sides and really quick a disclaimer <laughs> if you buy one of these wigs and you see that like it's sewn down the top ones in the back that is to cover you that is to make sure that when you're out flouncing around you won't um, be showing tracks because underneath I'll show you um, you see you got tracks and it's just basically showing that it's not coming out of your scalp Okay, and they're just trying to make sure you're covered. So when you're walking around You know what I mean? You're not showing anything you shouldn't be so do not cut those um, Threads unless you you choose to um, But that was just a quick disclaimer This is the 20 inch. That's what it's looking like. Okay The way I'm gonna install this is very much in a rush Cause that's what this is all about just trying to um get the look without all the excess right i'm gonna show you how i do it without even doing a ball cap because i don't really think it's necessary unless people are in your business that much you don't have to do a ball cap i know you're like but girl all this scalp is showing i'm gonna show you what i do and it's gonna be completely undetectable i promise okay but what i'm gonna do is take my light color cap and I'm going to take my foundation and I'm just going to saturate it really good. Make sure you get the band really good. And we're going to cover that whole space that is going to be showing in the top. Take your foundation and put it inside all over. Just like you would any other wig okay so now I have my foundation all over the cap so now I'm gonna put it on So really quick, I just want to say that since this is glueless, it's already really down on my head. But I'm going to go ahead and just take some got to be really good in between the hairline and the baby hairs and just spray it real good. Then 
just take your band and put it on there and let that marinate for a second. Okay, now we're gonna brush those baby hairs back just a little bit, get them out the way so that we can cut the lace off. Now, just to marinate everything again, get everything looking right, I'm gonna put just a little bit of foundation back around there, anything I might have lifted. And then I'm gonna take my got to be again and just spray right on that hairline. And then we're gonna tie it back down so that everything can be really flat and laid down, marinated and melted. Okay, so now, I'm gonna go ahead and comb those baby hairs back down. So really quickly, this is right after I style my baby hair. I did style them with styling foam. And as you can see, after I've done everything, I go back with the styling foam and put it on top. Um, just pat a little bit all the way around my forehead where my baby hairs are. And then I put on my elastic band and this is how I get them to stick and set. Um, you can do this really with any product you choose, but I use the styling foam. It works really well and also activates really good. I feel like with the got to be spray, it just makes everything look really, really good. Okay guys, so this is what it's looking like. Let me give you the wrap up real quick. So, I love this wig. I love the concept of getting something that takes so long and literally putting it on in 10 minutes. Um, especially after you've already like styled your baby hair. Like the next time I put this on, I'll put it on in five minutes and be done. Um, I didn't do a ball cap method and I'm totally getting away with it if you ask me. Um, I definitely think it should be in your repertoire. I'm definitely a believer in building a collection of wigs if you like to wear them. You know, bob, colored wig, long, super long wig, box braid wig. I think you should definitely try it, especially if, you know, you're the type of girl that like box braids, but you don't like the pain that comes along with it. Um, sitting in the chair for eight plus hours. You don't even have to sleep in this, which makes it even better for me. Um, cause y'all know after you, you go get them done and they're fresh and you lay down, you ain't getting no rest. Okay. So I really like that this is just giving you the look. Okay. Without all the hoopla and the drama, I must say, um, this would even be good for like a quick little getaway, you know, like weekend vacay. Um, maybe you have a, a, a day off and during spring break and you like trying to look the part and you want to get the box braids but of course you don't have time this is it you guys i really do like this like i said it comes in other lengths the 32 inch i know that one is banging um and on me since i'm 5'3 i mean it's hanging down the back pretty good so i know the 32 inch would have been killer but again this is it you guys so i hope you enjoyed it if you're feeling what you see if you like what i put down hit the like button hit the subscribe button um hit the bell make sure you hit all so you're getting all the notifications and when i put up new videos and that's that i really love it thank you guys for watching if you're still watching this 
far into the video and i will see you guys in the next one bye